Well, for many of you, getting gas over the past few days may have been a nightmare, but now there may be a new concern, and that's price gouging. The Attorney General's office has more than 600 people have filed complaints. CBS North Carolina's Robert Richardson for the second day joins us now live with uh, how state officials are working to protect drivers. Robert. For us, first of all, let me be clear, we're not accusing this Exxon of price gouge. The current price for regular unleaded is $239, which is pretty high, but the Attorney General's office says that they're investigating complaints of nearly double that price. Some drivers filed complaints reporting they saw gas as high as $4.50 a gallon in Guilford County. That station faces subpoenas, and the Attorney General's office says drivers are eyes and ears for investigators, and people need to report those high gas prices. There's no set amount that constitutes price gouging. The state says it's anything unreasonably excessive. I heard from my uh, two sons yesterday. They found one place it was $5, and that was you know, outraging. So compared to that, 240 is, I will say, it's all right. If you see excessive prices, go to the Attorney General's website. They have a form that allows you to file a complaint online, and you can also call 877-5-NO-SCAM. Attorney General Roy Cooper says he expects to send more subpoenas to more gas stations later this week, and the fines for price gouging are up to $5,000 for each violation. Reporting live in Raleigh, Robert Richardson, CBS North Carolina.